What's good y'all man, it is your boy Sniper Kicks and today's video man is gonna be a vlog we're going to my local boutique to see if we can pick up some heat. Guys, if you have a local boutique in your area, make sure you tap in and see what they have. Because a lot of times boutiques will get special shoes that a Foot Locker might not get. So I'm hoping to find a Jordan 1 Low that I'm looking for because I know this shoe right here is going to go up in price. I got some a couple weeks ago and they sold really, really fast. So I'm going to check to see if I can get some more, see what else I can pick up. We'll vlog, see what's in that store and keep this thing moving. So it's gonna be a festive vlog make sure you subscribe to the channel make sure you hit that like button and we're gonna get to it let's go so y'all we just got to the spot we're at a local boutique and we're gonna see what's in here but i already know what i want to grab because uh, these shoes right here are definitely gonna go up in price um, but let's go in and see what i can get let's get it going in so going in here not bad Jordan 11s, these right here, these mids, got some stuff in here, these are nice, got some stuff in here, the new joints, not a big fan, so let's take a look, over this way, got the hats here, and I see, still got a lot of stuff here, here, Vibes. Got these here. A lot of stuff sitting. Stage hazes. Heritage. But these are the ones. Guys, I don't know how people are sleeping on these. I do not know. Retail price, 130 Not a bad shoe. I'm going to grab this. Here as well. These are not bad, so. But these are the ones right here I'm gonna grab. He's been sitting forever. So, yeah, I'm going to the kid side. A lot of stuff here, still pollen. A lot of stuff. Stage hazes. Stage hazes. So they got seven or six pounds of these. But man, look at all these gray school shoes. Raging bulls. Like grab these. So ended up getting these right here. So let's take a look at what I got. So y'all, man, you saw that I picked up some shoes, man. Stage hazes on top of that. Uh, you already know the Jordan Low, fake royal, you know. Uh, I forgot the Mystic Navy, so we're gonna go in Nike, see what they got in here, and then keep it moving. Let's go. So overall, just see mids here. We got Heritages. And these two, these two are still sitting. So, so right here. Overall, these, not bad. These are like the, this couple is not bad if it wasn't a Zoom Comfort. But I don't know. Come in here, another Zoom Comfort. Got these lows, women's, not bad. These two. And with these, not bad. Spur Dunk. And got these. So you saw that Nike, there was nothing there. Sometimes you can find some gems in there. Uh, that Nike also has sneaker passes. They get random dunks. But uh, today they didn't have really anything. They didn't have nothing that I really uh, wanted, but I picked up some good shoes, man. Like, it's insane. Just going there and seeing all those retro sit, especially grade school sizes. There was at least 20, 20 retros that came out in the past year. And there's a lot of delayed shipments. So many delayed shipments. Like, you know, I talked to a lot of people that work at Nike and boutiques and Foot Locker's like, the late shipments are ridiculous and it's not because of like COVID guidelines. It's because of everything is back order. They're still trying to get stuff out and the car goes and trying to, they're, they're just behind. They're just behind. And that's why you do see a lot of those late shipments on shoes and stores getting them in late. So hopefully they get caught up, uh, but you know, we'll take a look at what I got at the crib and keep it moving. Let's go. 
What's good, Snipe Gang? Back at the crib. And man, got some good stuff at my local boutique. Guys, if you have a sneaker boutique in your area, make sure you tap in with them. There's a lot of time shoes that might sell out in a Foot Locker might sit at a boutique, depending what boutique it is. So make sure you tap in with your boutique. You saw all the shoes that were sitting. was able to grab a Nike Dunk, a Jordan 1 High, and a Jordan 1 low. So those shoes right there would probably be sold out at a Foot Locker, but I was able to get, you know, these shoes. So guys, let's take a look what I got. Before we get into that, I want to touch on something real quick. Late shipments. You know, it's been two years, late shipments. And what I've been hearing is not really the stuff is coming late overseas. It's just the cargo. There's so much on like back order of getting those cargoes off. It's just taking a while because Nike, I was at Nike yesterday and they were saying like, man, like we just got our Halloween stuff like two months ago and Halloween was last year. So a lot of things were coming in late. You saw Jordan Brand push back so many releases. I do not know when late shipments are going to stop or if they're ever going to stop. If stuff come in time, especially with the sneaker market, what it is now, a lot more things would actually sit because again, there's so many late shipments that man, but let's take a look at what I got right here. First shoe. It's a shoe that's starting to sell out at most stores now. Jordan one box, you know, this is a sleeper. People are going to regret not picking this shoe up right here. Jordan one stage haze retail pair gray school. I love the smell of Jordan ones, but right here picked up another pair of these. Definitely a dope shoe. Grabbed them. Really like that shoe, man. I grabbed a personal pair. So this shoe right here. Let's talk about this shoe right here. Let's talk about this shoe right here. Jordan One Low OG, and it comes with the original box. And these right here, the Jordan One Mystic Blues. Yes, these are not the Jordan 1 Royals, but they are so, so similar. So similar, man. Just the blue is off. It's not royal blue, it's mystic blue. Um, but overall, man, it's a good shoe. It's a good shoe. The leather is good on the black. The blue has good leather as well. Well executed shoe. This is a shoe right here. If you have capital to invest in a shoe, I would invest in this shoe. Again, I talked about the Bleach Coral Lows before. That's a great shoe, summer shoe. Next year, I feel like that shoe's gonna be over 200 and like 20 bucks, 230 bucks. But this shoe, I feel like people are going to sleep and end up being like, man, I wish I would've copped this shoe. So the Jordan 1 Low OG. Usually Jordan Low OGs do pretty well. And the colorway is really, really good because the Royal colorway is going for 100, 700, 800 bucks. So this shoe right here, I feel like by next year, and the capital is very low on this. I believe this is 130. Um, the resale price is 140. This is going to be over a $200 shoe by next year. Um, I believe it just because of colorway, just because it looks exactly like the Royal. And I recommend investing if you have capital. We're in a sneaker recession, so don't do it if you don't have money. I'm telling you that, but just want to give my two cents on this shoe. But anytime I see this shoe, I'm going to grab it. I'm going to grab it. I'm gonna grab it. So picked up that shoe. And the last shoe that I picked up is a Nike Dunk that is by an iconic player. And this is a little different Nike Dunk box. And we have these Lisa Leslie Dunks. This is dope, man. You have a personalized dunk. The quality on here is way better than a regular Nike Dunk. Like the quality is so much better than like a Panda or any dunk like that. But Lisa Leslie Dunks, you have the nine right there. You already know she played with the LA Sparks. Super, super dope shoe. Um, got this shoe right here, man, dope shoe. So guys, man, those are the shoes that I picked up. I wanted to talk about a little bit about that Jordan 1 Low Mystic Navy, because I feel like that shoe was just a sleeper. So just want to touch on that, guys. Really do appreciate you guys, man. Make sure you're checking your store. Hopefully, Jordan Brand starts coming out with releases. It's been weeks until Jordan Brands actually came out with something good. Those Jordan 1 High Woman Reds were just trash. But, you know, again, I'm hoping for some heat that is coming up soon. So, guys, really do appreciate you guys. You already know Sniper Kicks out. Peace.